Hi everyone, it's Jay Witty. Welcome to Friday with Friends. We are so glad that you are here. So October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And so this week we are paying tribute to all of the warriors um, who have survived breast cancer, um, to their families, their warriors as well, to friends who are the warriors, um, to everybody who's been pretty much affected by this horrible disease. And I probably would be safe to say that the majority of us have been affected by it in one way or another, whether we've been the one having to battle the, the disease or support a family member or support a friend. Um, I lost an aunt to breast cancer. I have a cousin who is currently battling breast cancer. And so um, I know that my family has been affected by it. So this piece um, is in honor of them and as well. So I started out with a 14 inch round. It's on my spinner. And um, I put down the um, Enchanted Iridescent Violet uh, as a base coat. Um, and then I used various forms of pink, deco art metallics pinks. I think I used a satin enamel pink in there <laughs> and a couple of different shades of purple. And I kept getting drawn to a teal that I had made up previously, oh, weeks ago for another pour. And something just kept telling me, put the teal in there, put the teal in there. So I went ahead and I did that. And it wasn't until after I did a little bit more uh, some research did I find out that teal actually represents ovarian cancer. And I, I, I lost both my mother and my sister to ovarian cancer. So this kind of re represents both both forms of cancer. Um, so it became very personal for me. And um, sorry, <laughs> cancer sucks. And we all know it. Anywho, I'm laying down my colors. I think my mixtures on this weren't exactly um, as thick as I would have liked them to be. I think they were a little too thin. And I really started to struggle with this piece. <laughs> um, I was trying to do, I guess, a wave. I wanted to do something in that effect. And it just wasn't working. So I kept layering and I kept blowing down and I kept doing the definition of insanity. You keep repeating the same thing over with the same results. But ultimately, um, I just kind of gave up on my concept of what I thought it was going to look like. And I just kept dumping paint on there, blowing it out, spinning it out a few times. And what I ended up with... Um, was what I was supposed to end up with. Uh, I do take you in for the wet and dried results at the end, um, and I give you two orientations of this piece. Um, I, I wish I could explain to you why this makes me so emotional, but this piece really <laughs> brings a lot of emotion out in me, and um, it just turned out beautiful. Uh, far better than I could have envisioned it to be when I first started this out. Um, and I hope that you see the beauty in this piece. I hope that you see the fights and the struggles and the, the, just the dream within um, these battles that all who are affected by this disease face. Um, and... Uh, I don't know. I'm at a loss of words. I think I need to stop talking right now. <laughs> um, this is my like fifth attempt to try and do a voiceover. So I'm going to put on some music, guys. Let me know what orientation you like best, um, whether it be the first or second one that I show you uh, in the dry results. And um, until next time, guys, please stay safe, take care, and blessings to you all. Bye-bye.
what if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars. Birds will sing about your heart Maybe the trees will whisper the word Maybe the sun will spread your joy to the ones who lost their hope real quick just to remind you that our special guest this evening is Tracy with Poor Perfection Art by Tracy. Um, the link to tonight's playlist is listed in the description box down below. Just tap on the title. It'll take you right there and you'll see every uh, all the artists in tonight's lineup for Friday with Friends. So again, thank you for being here. Bye-bye. Thank mm -hmm. you. 